Thanks for joining us for the news tonight. I'm Richard Gearhart and I'm Karina Corral with the lack of rainfall and as San Luis Obispo County officially is back in a drought. Officials here are considering ways to fill local reservoirs. One potential idea at the top of the list is cloud seeding. KSBY news reporter Alexa Bertola joins us live to explain Alexa. Karina cloud seeding is a process that increases the amount of rain. Now it's been done all over the world, including in Santa Barbara County, where it's been utilized for nearly 40 years. You're looking at video of cloud seeding. One way it works is through these ground dispensers placed near mountain ridges. The seeding agent will react with the clouds and will cause it to rain. Planes can also put the seeding agent, silver iodide, into the clouds. The idea here is that it'll increase the rain potential by about 10 to 15 percent. This could add thousands of acre feet of water to Lopez Lake in the Salinas Reservoir, better known as Santa Margarita Lake. It could add 6 to 12 percent capacity in Lopez and about 12 to 24 percent in Salinas. In 2012, cloud seeding was mentioned in the county's master water report. The drought definitely had um, a, a role in looking at this. A feasibility study was just completed last year. Santa Barbara County is no stranger to winter cloud seeding. Not all storms are seedable. The, the material is um, um, effective in certain temperature ranges. Um, the winds have to be in the right direction. Since 1981, Santa Barbara County has targeted the watershed upstream of Twitchell Dam and also the watersheds above Kachuma Lake. A couple of years ago, the numbers were reviewed. In the San Inez watershed, you can estimate about 20% increase of precipitation with seeding and in the Twitchell watershed about 10%. Slow county hopes for a comparable outcome. And the county is looking at eight different areas to place the ground dispensers. For now, live and local in San Luis Obispo, Alexa Bertola, KSBY News. Alexa, thank you. And the Board of Supervisors will take up cloud seeding June 19th.